In the Orthodox tradition we have a prayer called the Jesus Prayer. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me a sinner. The Jesus Prayer is a short prayer but it's repeated slowly and rhythmically, not like a mantra, but simply to enable the heart and mind to be drawn into an awareness of the presence of God. But the Jesus Prayer teaches us about prayer itself. It teaches us about all of our prayers. Elder Sophroni of Essex teaches us that when we pray we should avoid seeking sensation or artificial feelings, but simply focus the mind and the intellect entirely on God's presence. Become aware of whose presence we are in. This is true prayer. And the beginning of the Jesus Prayer helps us, Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God. It reminds us that we are in God's presence. But then the second part of the prayer, have mercy on me a sinner, have mercy on me. We call to mind the fact that God is infinitely merciful, infinitely forgiving and infinitely loving. This is where our hope is based, our hope of forgiveness, salvation and redemption, in God's mercy and grace. But the prayer ends, have mercy on me a sinner. As we remind ourselves of God's presence, we also remember who and what we are before God, fallen sinners, in need of God's mercy, in need of God's grace. The Jesus prayer rises, Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, and then descends, have mercy on me, a sinner. It brings us back to earth. We can't stay at the top of the mountain. We must descend again, return. So let's all of us use the Jesus prayer to remind ourselves that we are living in God's presence, that we find mercy in God's love, but we turn to him as sinners. And let us never waste another moment of our lives, whether we're in a shopping queue, or we're driving, or simply finding ourselves impatient while we wait for something. Bring to mind the Jesus prayer. Be aware that you are living in God's presence. Seek his mercy, ask his forgiveness.